BugEyeGuy.com with two leaf green 1960 bug eyes, both under one roof, both beautifully restored, both a little bit different. And it just makes me smile to see them both together. These are uh, some great restorations, and I just wanted to give you a quick tour. This is a bone stock car, Jean, totally original in its uh, restoration in that everything matches. It looks very much the way it would have looked the day it was on the showroom floor back in 1960. We have this period accessory steering wheel. I'm not sure if dealers ever offered that, but it's certainly something well within the realm of what a new owner might have put on his car to uh, change the appearance and the feel back in those days. It's a uh, really lovely car, excellent metal work. All the rust has been cut out and addressed. We have the stock um, and correct bug eye rims and tires as well. These are actually remanufactured Michelin tires, which are period accurate. Those are tires you may not have seen for a while with that tread pattern, but they're new tires. And we have a lot of great new parts up front, new suspension parts, and the engine and the running gear is all 948 and faithfully accurate to what you would have found in 1960 when this car was new. Over here on Cosmo, we have an amazing restoration. We've got a lot of performance additions and improvements. It has a little hotter cam and a 1275 engine, K&N air filters. And we also have Jerry Coker's signature on the inner fender. And if you are new to Bug Eyes, you may not know Jerry Coker is the fellow who drew the original Bug Eye design. So he's a very important man in terms of the heritage of this car. We have uh, a great restoration under the hood here. Amazingly clean, beautiful windshield wiper motor and new master cylinder. Everything painted well. Spin-off oil filter down there too and uh, air horn and an oil cooler up next to the grill and header there behind those K&N air filters. Silicone brake fluid, uh, knockoff wire wheels, chrome wire wheels, and amazing metal work. All the restoration work was extremely high quality. Very rare to find a car this well done. And again, another uh, add-on leather, leather padded steering wheel on this one. And amazing air horns and the right gauges. And he's chosen a little more lumbar, lumbar support for these Mark II seat covers. And I have to agree with them. They are actually more comfortable, although they're not exactly correct. Then we've got new side curtains and tonneau. And this is a, a nice case for our new top tube and side curtain wallet because obviously we've got some weaponry hanging out back here. These sharp edges are not really desirable. That's why we've come up with these other products to protect everything. You can slide it further back into the boot. We've got the original hard top on this car at the moment and just a lovely finish. There you have it, a quick tour of two beautiful 1960 Bug Eyes here at BugEyeGuy.com.